You're the least stupid thing in this whole stupid town. Okay. It could be someone younger saying this. You're the best person to watch bad TV with. And if your life was an email list, I'd subscribe. You have a channel or some type of platform. I can't understand why you want to make an enemy out of this person. You, there are people that got checked. Yeah, why do you want to get even for you? You guys are sitting here with your handouts. You're, yeah, you don't have shit or... You, you had to borrow a bra from someone and you're going to sit there and talk shit on that one. You got the balls to sit there and judge. This is coming from a teenager, actually. The, the, even younger. And they actually said, you're going to reap what you sow. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I love this. Yep. Justice. That is a beautiful thing. They're fine. They're speaking up now. And I have a feeling that they're calling judgment out on people. Even if it's not in front of other people, they could be in their mind or just they know that it's a sense of believing it. So there's a young man who sat there and said, basically in his own way, every time that you judge someone else and you should be judging yourself, something bad's going to happen to you. That's all. And it's, it's happening. O.V. VM and if he has a Venmo or she has a Venmo FR they could be getting they could have a platform or something for someone but they're younger they're younger it's odd to come from someone like this VVF nope VMF Vertical motion flatulation. <laughs> they did that? So they're that young. Okay, I got it. That's how they ended it. That's their that's their affirmative exclamation point. I like it. Stay tuned. Had more than one speeding ticket in one day. How do you how do you have this many tickets and you're not locked up? Shadow side. I could have chose any direction, but I keep choosing this one. Tell me about this. new things maybe you need to do something different mm -hmm. yeah this is also I'm not covering for you anymore this shit is starting to look bad this is somebody who is works this is a clerk possibly who forges or alters they do this from home they take some type of paperwork or they're in the system and they're not supposed to be taking, they're not supposed to be doing this shit outside of the office. This now looks like the a court, a government building, yeah. Personal. Okay, that's it. Are you doing it for family or friend or allowing yourself to be bribed is what I just heard. Leo. Now what's going to happen? You started doing this a little bit and a little bit and a little bit, but now this is getting exposed, all, all this bullshit now. And this could even be the news or, or someone that works for the paper. This, it's not just this, it's what stems from this. You have child trafficking, organ trafficking, this, that, and the other going on. And this is what you guys are focusing on, tickets. Yeah, this could even be police officers. 
that uh, that's all you're focusing on is is making money off of tickets and shit like that. It started out just that. Now it got into something bigger. King of Swords. Who is this guy? This is a governor or a mayor even. Working together and doing this shit too. He could be, they could be the one with all the tickets. How the fuck are you arresting this person? And you have, this is an immense amount of tickets for someone. L.A., this could definitely be Los Angeles. The Alamo, I just heard. B.C. And O.L. Love comes later. Tell me there's a female that works there and he's been promising her something. I'll take you out. I promise. I'll take you out. I promise. Yeah, your judgment is way off. But all oh, seeing that sees everything. God damn it. Somebody does. Why are they scared? There's, an there's another cop here. This police department has been... They're being investigated for a long time. And I'm guessing that the shit that's going to be coming out about this, they're going to be arresting. This is Secret Service and all kinds of shit. Yep, we got to do something. This is getting ridiculous. There's no... there's. I don't know if this is every police department. It doesn't feel like it. It feels like there's one in particular that is so freaking corrupt. It's, it's overwhelming. We, we've been in this city, we've been in this state. They're an actual convict working there? Great. And the mayor could even be, or governor could even be a convict. How, is, how are the people, how is your chief, your commissioner, your mayor, your governor, your cops, most of them, not all, but for some it may be the entire judicial system in a certain city are convicts. They've been bringing them in. This is how they get them to do this shit. And then they tell them, if you don't do what we want you to do, and then someone's going to go, yeah, 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 that's it. Yeah, You didn't want to do this willingly because you're just corrupt and you just don't know when to stop. But there are a lot of them where they were brought over here to this country from other countries, and they were told they were going to be able to do this out of the other. And then when they got here, they said, look, this is what you need to do. We're going to give you this badge or this job. This is what you have to do, or we're going to lock you up. Ned, Jed, Sid, um, Reds, this could be Cincinnati. Kyle, Addison. Second all, barbiturate, downer. This is also cigarettes, I'm guessing. Marble Reds, I don't know what that would have to do with it. Oh, they're showing me in Goodfellas when they were selling the shit out of the back. That's also down to that, too. Every sink, they've been there for a month, and every single thing that this police department and everything connected to it, everything they do is corrupt. This is the most corrupt city when it comes to their police department and their government building and everything, the judge, down to the judges. Tell me more about this. Somebody came in or is there to do some shit here. This is, this, I mean, this could be Billy with the art museum there. Over. Oh, okay. It feels like it's way out of con How do we fix this? This used to be a real strong city. This, this definitely could be Philly. 
I know that this is a Philly deck, but I'm, I'm definitely drawn or a city near Philly. Divine Feminine. This is a female mayor or governor. I mean, do you stand for justice at all? What the hell did you get into this shit? And her, and her child? What kind of home are you living in? That's what it was. Yeah, the only reason you're successful, and it seems like all of your friends are successful, is because you're opportunists. They're finding out about them forging signatures, documents, taking people's homes that were left to them and everything. This is going to be huge. And I don't feel like it's just one city. I feel like it's a lot of them, but it started with one because there's possibly a divine feminine who started exposing this shit. And they're finally looking into the shit or it's about to happen. Oh, insurance with the life insurance scamming and everything. This actually is really, this is really happening. How bad is this? And hopefully there will be laws or we'll be able to get rid of life insurance altogether. Nowhere. Bye.